Hi, this is Orange Elementary. You're watching CNUSD TV. And I'm from Orange Elementary. We're here at Santiago. It's a field trip for us, so the whole entire fifth grade of our school is here. We are here trying to code blocks and things on our computers to to make um, the computer do so, stuff that we want to do. For like right now, we're doing BBA, or if you finish that, you would do another coding and you would have to pick up scraps of BBA and you would have to have these blocks. So right now I'm just uh, dragging these little blocks up to um, the command and it's like when run and then it's like move right, you go down and then it would go left. And then I'm gonna do another left to get to right here to round, then I go down. I'm gonna, I'm doing the Minecraft. It makes this thing run over there, so it moves forward. I could turn it left or right. These are the keys. You could also use this. It's the exact same one. Right now I'm playing Flappy Bird, and what I have to code to see where I'm going to go, how I'm going to do it, and how, how I need to flap. I'm very interested in computers and, and engineering. As part of their What If Week activities, Home Gardens Academy students participated in a community cleanup. Several groups of students participated in either graffiti cleanup, trash pickup, or flyer distribution. I felt like it was good, like picking up everything because it's really good for our community. Like, trash everywhere, we pick it up. It's really good, like to make everything look clean. It's good. It was basically. Um... We, were, we had to be productive today. We were cleaning up our community. Some people back here were like grilling food. Some people were making pictures. Some of us were like picking out weeds and painting. Basically this whole day was about being productive and doing something to help the community. I think it teaches us how to um, take care of our community. It's not the best neighborhood to be around and people see us and I think like they think we're doing good stuff and I think it encourages them to do good stuff too. What if we get students thinking about social situations and how to create an even more positive school environment? The new school buildings at the four construction sites have come a long way since construction started in the summer of 2016. Here is where each site is at. As always, we want to thank the voters in the Corona Norco Unified School District for their trust and approval of Measure GG. We will always strive to continue our tradition of excellence and build upon our community's confidence in our schools. The future of our schools is secured and we couldn't have done it without your help. Thank you for your contribution in creating far-reaching positive educational opportunities for our students today and for generations to come. For more information about Measure GG projects, visit our website.